Texas Senator Ted Cruz is back in the Granite State for the first time as an officially declared presidential candidate, and he's ready to meet the skeptics head on, saying he is the one who can ignite and inspire the Republican base. It's 3 p.m. on a Friday in Merrimack, and first in the nation voters are crowding into the VFW hall. Ted Cruz says these are the same kind of grassroots Republicans who propelled him to the U.S. Senate in 2012. I really have been so encouraged at, at the incredible support we're seeing here on the ground in New Hampshire. In a sit-down interview with News 9, Senator Cruz addressed criticism that flared up this week over his family's health insurance. With his wife joining his campaign and leaving her private sector job, Cruz, the fierce opponent of Obamacare, will be obtaining the coverage offered through his employer, the federal government. A lot of folks in, in the, the mainstream media, the national media, tried to play gotcha and to say, well, that means you're on Obamacare. Look, every one of us is bound by the law. Obamacare is a disaster, and no one has fought harder to repeal it, but I'm also fighting for a flat tax. Doesn't mean I refuse to pay my taxes in the meantime. GOP activists say the outspoken conservatism that causes Cruz to so frequently take fire from his left will be his biggest asset in the primary. Well, I think the strength he brings is that he's a true conservative, a constitutionalist, and I think there's a lot of voters in New Hampshire looking for that. Trying to stand out from what could be a crowded field, the senator is encouraging Granite Staters to press other White House hopefuls to show what they've done to defend the Constitution. And that's one thing I have a lot of faith in the people of New Hampshire. They're going to ask those questions, and they're going to make the judgment for every candidate who has actually walked the walk rather than just talking the talk. This is a two-day swing through the state for Senator Cruz. On Saturday, he'll be meeting with Republicans on the seacoast for brunch in Greenland. Reporting in Nashua, Adam Sexton, WMUR News 9.